Velasquez, 10 starts this year. Got to be better than his last outing when he threw 24 pitches in the first inning in San Francisco, but then followed it up with 36 in the second inning. Swing and a miss. Well, that is a good start. One out here in the first. Here's Juan Soto, a 279 hitter. Out to center field. Odubel Herrera started back, comes sprinting in. He makes the catch, diving forward, and the inning is over. It is a much better first inning for Velasquez today, and his outfielders are showing their speed. Eric Fetty, nine games, eight starts career against the Phils with a two and five record, 528 ERA. Four pitch guy, two seam fastball cutter, which we will talk about at length this afternoon. Curveball and changeup. Curveball has been dominant to righties. The changeup has been lights out to lefties. Jammed him with the fastball. Drifting for it. Trey was alone on the left side, one out. And this one, a little tweener, but Turner with his momentum toward the bag made it look a lot easier than it was. So a two out base runner and Al Fetty will face the Phillies catcher JT Realmuto. In the air to right. But he didn't come close to getting it. Eric Fetty walks Harper. That's fine. Scoreless early. The end of the inning, Eric Fetty walked over. Alfonso Marquez, Tim Timmons, they took a look at the glove. Tim Timmons looking at it. Harper, uh, Harper uh, listening to Ryan Zimmerman and Max Scherzer. About getting his hair checked, he does have a lot of product, I think, going on in that hair. Well, it's pretty hair. I, you know, I can see why he'd want to take care of it, Tom. <laughs> and now Travis Jankowski is coming up. He's appeared in 15 games prior to today, all as either a pinch hitter or defensive replacement or pinch runner. His first start of the year. That one's hit well out to right field. Soto's going back. It is gone. Just under the base of the auxiliary scoreboard, a three run home run, and the Phillies take the early lead. You did smell runs. Travis Jankowski, the Lancaster products. Got the hat, though, the Homer hat. And into center, Victor Robles. Odubel Herrera is now 0 for his last 12, but an unlikely source of power. Travis Jankowski puts the fills on top. So there's one away. To bring up Bryce Harper. Two balls, two strikes. That one is out toward left center field. Out toward the wall. It is into the flower bed. Just over the small fence. An opposite field home run Ooh. for Bryce Harper. Back to back days. He's homered. Yeah, they still are ball solos. But the Phillies add to their lead. It's four to nothing. Homer hat busy today. Four nothing Phillies lead it. Kyle Schwarber leads off. Swing and a miss. He threw another changeup to pick up his fourth strikeout. He's got a strikeout in each inning so far. Trey Turner is next. Turner rips one, and that's beyond the reach of Alec Bone. It'll kick out into the short corner area. And Trey Turner with his 88th hit of the year. Finally gets the Nats an entry in the book. One two pitch. Over to the second base side again. Brad Miller waits for it. And the inning is over. Nice job by Velasquez to work around the one out double by Trey Turner. That's the first hit of the day for the Nats. Travis Jankowski the batter. And a line drive base hit it to right That's field. Two, baby. And Jankowski can run and he's on his way to second. And he's there with a stand up double. He's got a home run and now a double. Torres moves the runner along. There's a line drive into left field, a base hit for Velasquez. Jankowski scores, and the Phillies add on another. It's 5 0. The Nationals have runners on first and second with nobody out. Starlin Castro, the batter. What a pitch up. Castro, left field line. Harrison will score. Avila rounding and heading for third base. Starlin Castro got a pitch up. And the Nats are in business here in the fifth inning. Nationals have Robles at the plate. In the air, but not deep at all. Uh oh. And the ball's on the ground. Everybody moves up, and it's a five to two game. Miller and Herrera, and the Nats get a huge break. Well, that'll bring up Para. And the pitch. Swing and a miss. He got 94, and that's a huge strikeout. It's the fifth. Here comes Joe Girardi. That's going to be it for Velasquez. 
Phillies will make a pitching change with one out here in the top of the fifth inning. Archie Bradley on for the Phillies here. Comes into a situation. Runners first and third, one out, and facing Kyle Schwarber. On a breaking ball. It's hit well to left. See you later. New pitcher. New ball game. Schwarber, number 19, and the Nats have tied it. Bang! Zoom goes Schwarber again. Six home runs in the last four games. And the Phils with a chance to break this tie. So that'll bring up Torres. And that's ball four. That'll load the bases up. McCutcheon is going to be announced as a pinch hitter. So one pitch coming, and that one's out toward left field. Schwarber's going back toward the wall. It is gone! Grand slam! Andrew McCutcheon off the bench. This is going to be one of the greatest rock, paper, scissors of all time. And the Phillies take a 9 5 lead. The walk loads the bases for Trey Turner. Already he kicks and throws. Swing a line drive right side. Base hit right field. Headed home Castro. Robles will score as well. Holding it second is Schwarber. And Trey Turner brings the Nationals within a pair. It's now 9 7. Well, the Nationals, who've had so many struggles with the bases loaded, had Turner's hit a moment ago. And now Bell gets a chance. Bell. Big fly. Left center. C. You later. Unreal. These Nationals. 11 runs on the board over the last two innings. And the Nationals are in front for the first time, amazingly. Hear them boo. 